All right, Judy and I are here to show you some quick ways to work on resource guarding prevention when it comes to the food bowl. Typically, as we humans do this all backwards. We fill the bowl full of food, present it to the dog, and then either work at getting our hands in there while the dog is actively eating, or working at pulling the food back away from them, or removing them from the food so that we can then take it away. And that doesn't really build trust. Right? So if I'm out with my friends and I have a plate of fries and my friend starts munching on my fries without asking, I might get a little irritated depending on how hangry I am at that moment, right? Because they didn't ask and maybe I wasn't planning on sharing because I was starving. That's the same principle with dogs, okay? Um, only the communication isn't really there to necessarily ask. And so that's not a way that we build trust. That's a way that we kind of remove the trust from the relationship with the food bowl. So the way that we're gonna build trust is I'm gonna give Jude an empty food bowl. And this is generally with puppies, the only time I recommend feeding out of a food bowl is during this kind of activity. And we like to change the bowl or the, you know, the bowl type often just so, because they all have different things. So this one is reflective and it makes a nice ting. Glass ones are weird, especially if they can see through it. Plastic is another kind of texture. So we like to play around with that. So I'm gonna give him the food bowl. It's empty and he says, hey, wait, there's nothing in there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop one piece of dog food in there at a time and let him take it out. And as you can see, his head popped right back up at me like, okay, where's my next one? And this is the reaction that I want from my dog when my hand goes towards the food bowl. I want them to see that my hand is bringing the food, not taking it away. And I want them to go, okay, I'm ready for another one. So this just builds positive associations for him, me, and the food bowl.